Tanner, I don't know if you remember, but this time last year, you, you, you entered this part of the season as like a 270 hitter, and then you ended the season at around 320 or so. Is it something about the warm weather? Is it just that you're starting to feel warmed up to the season? What, what, uh, is, it, what is it about the month? I mean, I really just think it's just uh, the mentality of finishing strong. Um, you know, that's been implemented us, uh, you know, since the fall and just finishing strong and, uh, you know, I think as, as the season progresses, the games become a little bit more important maybe and you start to realize stuff and, you know, that's that's when I try to play my best. How special was it to, to get that hit and get the win on, especially when you, know, you have the senior day festivities before the game? Yeah. No, it, it was awesome. Uh, it's great and, you know, I just, I, you know, feel so happy knowing this program's in great hands with this coaching staff and, you know, to, to see a freshman come out and pitch like that. Uh, you know, starting outing like that is just, it just shows how bright the future is for this program. And, you know, it's just, it's a, it's a great way to play your last game at PK Park. Well, Chase, I think you only had three strikeouts, but it, I mean, you retired 16 straight batters there for a little bit. For, for a guy to pitch to contact against this lineup and do that well, is it just really impressive for yeah, you guys to see? Yeah, unbelievably impressive. You know, they, they got great hitters through and through. And, you know, if, if you're not striking them out, usually they're, they're putting balls in play and getting hits. And, uh, you know, they weren't able to do that today, and he did a great job just shutting it down and, and letting the offense work. You uh, were nominated for the Senior Class Award. So is Sam Nowitzki, who comes off the bench today and, and gets a hit on Senior Day as well. What do you think that moment meant to him and as a fellow senior for you? It's just awesome. It's, you know, it's a great honor, and, uh, you know, it's just great to have a couple Ducks, you know, uh, nominated for that award, and, um, you know, hopefully we can come out on top with that. You guys sweep Arizona. Now you're probably going to play them again on Wednesday. You like how you know, match up against them? Yeah, no. Uh, I like it. And, uh, you know, obviously we've been on the other end of the, that equation this season of playing a team a, a consecutive amount of times. And uh, we do know it's tough. And, uh, you know, but we are looking forward to it. Was it a priority for you guys to come out here and show the selection committee that you deserve to be in that conversation to host a regional? Is that, is that something you guys thought about? Uh, a little bit. Um, you know, I think, you know, what's what's big is just, uh, it's really just winning on Sundays. And we kept it as simple as that. And, uh, you know, and, and, and finishing this series strong and not, you know, settling with two or three, but really trying to, you know, uh, if this is our last game at PK, that, you know, we, we, we finish it right. How much does it help you personally that you're you know, I, I think it's pretty helpful. I think this weekend they used a lot more pitchers than they were planning to use. Um, you know, maybe not so much yesterday, but you know, throughout the whole weekend. So I think it's it's great for not only me individually, but just our offense in general to see kind of what we're working with, what what the plan of attack is going to be for each guy, and uh, you know, I think it is really beneficial going forward. And on the flip side, I mean, Aon throws a complete game yesterday. Chase goes seven today. It's helpful on that front, right? Oh, it's awesome. It's awesome. You know, when you only have to use Britain for one guy and, you know, um, you know, Colby, you know, got a couple innings this weekend and stuff. But it's, it's uh, you know, it's awesome. They have a lot of weapons in that bullpen that, you know, didn't really get utilized too much this weekend. And I think that's going to be big um, going forward for the you know, busy five days coming up. You guys secure the number four seed, which means Wednesday at 9 a.m. Yeah. How different does your schedule look from 9 a.m. baseball game? <laughs> you know, uh, I guess that'll be the first time in, uh, in a while since I was a little kid in the travel ball days. But, you know, I think, honestly, a lot of us are pretty happy about it, hoping that that's probably going to be the coolest time of the day out there and, uh, you know, and, and, and getting a win early to start the day.